Hey Capricorn, welcome to my channel. This is your next 24 hour star reading session for you, Capricorn. I hope you are well. I hope you're finding safe and doing good, Capricorn. This weaving for today, this is for you. Let us see what's happening towards you guys. What is the message that is meant for you to know? And ready for you to know, this is for the sign of Capricorn, okay? Before I start, Capricorn, I would like to thank you for being here. Excuse me. Thank you so much for supporting the channel. Guest viewers, if you haven't clicked the bell, click the bell now and click subscribe. Let's see what's coming towards you guys, okay? This is your next 24 hours reading. Let's see what's coming towards you. If you would like to further connect with me, Capricorn, I invite you to also follow um us on our new channel the details of the new channel it's down the description box below let's see what's coming towards you okay what's the message for in career finance love and general situationship this is for the capricorn sign mm. um you've got an auntie you've got an auntie or a mother that miss you capricorn like there's a female like if you are a male Capricorn, your mother, your auntie, there's a female that miss you, okay? Uh, give them a call, all right? Um, okay, so let's start your reading. You have the King of Wands. Um, I feel like Capricorn, there is something that you turn, like there, there's, a, there's something that you're working on, like King of Wands, it's looking in the past, okay? Um, there's something that has made you there's something in the past it could be a person it could be a project it could be travel but there's something in the past that you're looking into king of wands i feel like it this is a very new ish energy you 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 found a very like there's a part of you that it's interested to look into the past six of cups king of wands like there is uh, an interest and excitement at the same time um, reviewing looking into the past it could be a person a place you visit a project something that you put it on pause and now you're starting to feel like you could try it again with the situation in the past and it's more doable okay um, there is um, what do you call this? More of a... Um, I would say you're excited to do it again with somebody, with someone. Could be a project. It's really interesting that you... You're starting to... You're starting to feel like, mm, I think I can do it. Or I'm interested with it and I think I have this success, you know. Because I feel like um, you weren't able to give your all. You know, you weren't able to give your all with a situation, with a person, and you're looking into doing it again. It could be, um, it could be connected to a male who has a letter R, or it could be related or connected to a female, and they have like a um, blonde hair, you know, and it's connected to a past, okay, connected to past situation, past person, okay. Yeah, Six of Pentacles, I feel like you're ready to forgive someone. I feel like you are ready to try a business again, business partnership. There's a part of you that it seems to be you're more confident to deal with this person, project, situation, could also be an energy. Uh, when I say energy, it could be a strong interest and it's coming really from the past. I'm really getting a lot of past in here. Two of Swords. You know, with the Two of Swords, I feel like Six of Pentacles, the Two of Swords, I feel like if 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 you overthink, you might delay this again. You know, uh, Two of Swords. So you're going to follow your gut instinct. You're going to follow your passion versus overthinking. Because with the Two of Swords, Six of Pentacles, if you, if you overthink it, if you plan and plan and plan, like if you, ov if you over prepare, you feel like an over preparing like super duper like sorry like if you over prepare or overthink about it 
you feel like it's not going to be successful. So what you'll do, King of Wands, Nine of Wands, Six of Cups, is just go with the flow. Nine of Wands, I feel like um, you're just going to be on the watch. You know, you're just going to like, let's meet in the eye. You know, like you're going to pick up where you left and then continue it with more excitement. Like you're going to drive everything in passion. Okay, it's very passionate and you're just going to be really... You know, with this reading, you're, you're kind of being advised to be yourself. Be yourself. That's it. Like, if you overthink it, it might fail. If you overmanage it, if you give over energy, if you give more than what, it's, what is expected, you know that it might fail. Okay? So, you're just chill and go with the flow and you're going to follow your instinct and most specifically your passion. Three of Wands, you have a future. It could be a romantic situation. It could be, you might be invited for a date or you might be invited for an interview. You might be invited for a business transaction, but it's really something good. This could bring you money. This could bring you excitement again to be in a relationship. Whatever this is, this really feels good and it's very timely. Um, you're expecting and your expectation is, I would say, Capricorn, your expectation is actually on, on, not on the dot, but your expectation is actually correct. Like, your expectation is right. Uh, Wheel of Fortune, you know, it's going to happen. You know, the Three of Wands, the Page of Wands, you know, you don't have a Two of Wands in here because it's happening. It will happen for you. So, good news because your expectation is coming through. Because... I feel like the key to this dating or getting to know because I feel like you might be invited for a date for some of you finally someone will travel to see you there's a business transaction finally there's this a closing of business for some of you guys like like finally you sorry you'll manage to get a sale for some of you for some of you like you, you manage to get the deal, a sign of, for some of you, it's an actual date, for some of you, an invitation. Whatever this is, you're going to skip the queue. Because from three to one, there should be number two. You skip that. It means that no more BS. <laughs> like this is very straightforward. You are in a very, I feel like it's more of next week. Next week, Capricorn, where it's all going to happen. And when it happens... I really like the energy that King of Wands. You're just going to go with the flow. You're going to be passionate. You're going to be straightforward. You're really going to be very blunt with the person, with the situation. Like, thick face. I want this, you know, I want this person. I'm going to be blunt. I'm going to be open. I'm just going to open, you know, like, <laughs> like a peacock. You're going to open everything up. You're going to say whatever you feel, you know, your, you know, whatever is your deal and stuff like that. This, this. King of Wands, there's so conf there's so much confidence coming from you. You could be like you could be, I don't know, actress, actor, singing for some of you, but you're gonna be a center stage. Like you're gonna be a center of attention of someone, somebody. And you guys seems to be unstoppable. Like you will feel in your intuition that this is my time. I also get like strength card. I will use all of my strength, my passion to make it happen. Like I feel like a Capricorn energy where, no, this is mine. I'm going to make it work. I'm going to own this. I want this job. I want this person. I want this life. I would not entertain a no. I will only get a yes. So there's, you know, Queen of Cups, the High Priestess, like you're really, really manifesting this relationship to happen. It could be a romantic relationship. It could be a business relationship. But whatever this is, this is a partnership to someone that you've been manifesting. This is... This is something really close to her heart. Look at the Queen of Cups. She closed her eyes. She imagined, you know, she closed her eyes and she imagined it for, for so long and she manifested it. And here you go. In front of you is the cup. In front of you is the person that you've manifested. In front of you is a situation you've manifested. In front of you is something that you've manifested and manifested. And this is something really, really special and close to your heart, you know. You could smell victory, success, and you could smell love. Look at that. You're so close. You're so close to something. It could be an ambition. It could be... But it's something that you never gave up. You know, it's something that you never gave up. You know you know, you know, know that this would happen. You know that they will contact you. You know that you're going to be interviewed. 
you know that this manifestation if if there was a delay you you feel like you know one day it will be mine and here is it you know with the wheel of fortune the king of wands and the high priestess i feel like it's more of mid-month there is a cosmo there's an astrology move um that is really inspiring mid-month so i feel like this is you this is one of the you know kisses from the stars for you capricorn it is very passionate it's unstoppable and i feel like there's so much confidence coming from you that i want it i will take it you know like you're not shy you don't like you talk very confidently you you know you're just yourself imagine imagine yourself talk active and confident and you just know what you're talking about and it's 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 your excitement and your passion put it all together and you know really really wanting to make it work that's the ingredients that like that's the style you're being yourself with extra supercharge of excitement that's that's how i say it could be an interview but it's a very auspicious time i would say it's a very it, it is your time to have it it's your time to shine it's time to have you know, sometimes it could be the right person, but the wrong timing. Well, this is it. This is the right person, the right timing. This is the right offer and the right timing. Could be the right job, the right timing. So those two elements, it's very much pre present in here. Like as soon as you step in, as soon as you call, as soon as they call you or text you, as soon as you communicate, there's no barrier. One of my clue when an offer or a situation is for me, when I'm gonna get it is because there's there's no delay. If there's gonna be a delay, it's it's always gonna be positive and you're always gonna get it. So this is something I'm meant to be. What's meant to be will meant to be. It will always catch up on you. And this catch ups on you. This, you know, this followed you. And I think you believe deep, deep in your heart with the high priestess that I'm gonna get it. One day I'm gonna get it. One day I'm gonna talk to it. One day I'm gonna have my chance. And I'm not going to miss that opportunity again. And here you go. No, it's not a missed opportunity. It's actually happening. Yes. So Capricorn, thank you so much. You have an amazing energy. You're full of life. You're full of passion. Whatever it is, keep it. Because it's something that you've been wanting and looking forward for. And you've been manifesting it for quite some time. It is happening now. So open your eyes and embrace this amazing journey, this amazing opportunity, this amazing person. It's so close to you. It's within reach. Yes. Wow. Look at, let's look at that. Yeah. Three of swords. It has gave you a lot of, I'd say, disappointment in the past, but not. that's not going to work. Like I feel like you, you become so strong. You know, you become so strong because you know, like, I've, I've gone through this no more. I want this Queen of Cups. Like I really feel like you like blood, sweat, and tears. But you know you're still here, Queen of Cups. I'm gonna own it. I'm gonna have it. I deserve it. Wow, so strong. Whatever this is, enjoy. It is your time, Capricorn. And um, this is your reading. I'm seeing three, three, three. <laughs> Thank you so much for being here. I'm seeing three, three, three. Look at that. You know, in the notebook I've got. It's even have three, three, three. Look at that. Three, sorry. Need to share it with you. Three, three, three. Look at that. And there's a ding. The ding. It means that I need to go. <laughs> See you guys. Bye bye.